Hello everyone, ATB Tarot here with you today, bringing spiritual messages always with God's permission. You will have someone looking for you after a long time to have a conversation or explain something. This person hid something from you and now they are going through a very difficult karma. They will then look for you to tell the truth. I feel these are old things. This person may not necessarily be from a relationship. It could be someone who stole something from you in the past or lied. A spirit is channeling a message, so it's not for everyone. See if this message is for you, because what this spirit is saying is that in the past you had someone who told you about a betrayal. Maybe a friend, a relative told you that your partner was betraying you, and it might even have been said that they were cheating with this person, which wasn't true. You might have even separated because of this, and now they come to say this. Another situation is this person had a relationship with you and brought a lot of suffering and now they are starting to go through karma. This person doesn't even have the courage to talk to you. They think about it. They know that if they don't speak, they will have this regret eating at them, but they don't know how to approach and talk to you. Moving on, I see that maybe you will take a trip or make a change. I see that you will also receive a call, an email, WhatsApp about a contract that you're waiting for a response or a job response. Some of you are a bit nostalgic about family matters or you're a bit nostalgic about your situation now because of age. This spirit is saying that some of you are not comfortable with age or you miss and are recalling your youth. Some of you are looking back and are a bit sad because you look back and see how much you helped so many people in life and all these people you helped, they disappeared. None of them are around to also help or share or thank. It seems like all the people disappeared. So it's a nostalgic moment you are going through. Maybe it's a review and reflection on how you deal with life. The need to maybe be changing your expectation about people. ATB will say something. We cannot put any of our actions in the expectation of return. When you do something for someone, you do it because you want to. Don't expect a return. Don't have expectations from people you helped or didn't help because when we put our happiness in another person, we won't be happy. So often, do what you want to do for others without expecting anything in return or don't do it. Here, I also see that there will be an invitation for you. You will go to someone's house. There will be a celebration or you will meet at some restaurant, cinema, some public place. There will be a party, you will be invited, and at this party, they will introduce you to a very interesting person. Prepare your house because you will receive a relative visit. And this relative comes to ask for something. For some, this relative comes to talk about a pregnancy, or it could be a child announcing a pregnancy, coming to visit you, announcing a pregnancy. Some of you will be grandparents. I also see that there is an economic situation that you will have to be very careful about because something related to legal proceedings, inventory, separation, retirement, what is related to law and document, here it says for you to be very careful because there is something there that is not right. Someone is acting in bad faith, but I think you already know because here I see that you were disappointed with someone you didn't believe could have done this to you. It's something to do with legality, law, papers, properties, and the spirits say, dear sons, dear daughters, far superior than that for this person comes God's justice. Here I also see that some of you will deliver money to someone or someone will deliver money to you. Economically, you will thank God for the infinite mercy and glory because unexpected money will come into your hands. You will start paying your debts, your commitments, and you will be relieved because I feel that you are almost getting into depression. At the beginning of the reading, when those spirit messages came about nostalgia, looking at yourself in the mirror, seeing that you are already tired, aging, that you would have the right to rest now, retire, and there's no money. I see that it's a bit of depression too. So no depression for you. Live life in its abundance, enjoy and enjoy divine creation. Get up now from that sofa, that chair, raise your hands to the sky and say, I can, I deserve, I receive, I share, and I thank and manifest to God. You can be there now entering WhatsApp, talk to the attendants, and they will bring you all the explanations. I hope to soon have a meeting with you. Um, I, I invite you 
to do the transformative reading together with your mentor spirit and deceased loved ones so that in a spiritual session you can know your divine purpose of abundance and love. I invite you to do the numerology of luck together with the gypsy people, bringing abundance, wealth, fortune into your life. I invite you to do um, the spiritual cleansings, opening the paths for love, abundance, health, family union, and for your wishes to be fulfilled. I invite you to do a complete tarot reading. I invite you to make the pact of wealth with the Exu of Gold. Do your numerology now. Do your spiritual cleansing now. Your complete tarot reading is the greatest and best investment of your life the transformative reading that is done together with the mental spirits with your deceased ancestors. My mission is to bring you your abundance. It is to show you your path, your mission, your path to prosperity. Through the guiding spirits of light and love, thousands of people have already benefited from these readings. Thousands of people have found their path to wealth, prosperity, health, and love. Read also, get my books, How to Be a Billionaire, How to Be Healthy, How to Have Love. I hope to see you later. Ooh.